Hello, welcome to Cocktail Hour. I'm your host, Maxim Shakem, and this is episode 17 of a 45-part series coming out weekly. Now, with it being fall season and you, the watcher, acquiring a significant other for the time being, of course, we all know how these things go, you're going to really enjoy yourselves, and you're going to want to have some drinks built for two. Well, look no further, because I have the drink for you. This is a simple 16-part cocktail and all that it requires is you just ship three different beverages from out of country i have one from bhutan zimbabwe and argentina now this is all ridiculously expensive but don't worry you'll be enjoying yourselves and you will enjoy them and they will enjoy you now without further ado let's get shaken Now, we here at Maxim Mixologies do take pride in our unconventional methods. This is what you get from winning the regional best cocktail for 16 years running. The first thing we want is ingredients. Now, I will show you the ingredients as I'm using them, and the ingredients list will be listed below. Now, you're going to start with a simple container of the good stuff. Everything here, as I said before in my last videos, you eyeball it. You look at it and you say, hmm. I like you, and how much of you do I want? We're going to start with an eyeball of the yellow stuff. Followed up by a little container of Now to add some real body to this drink, we're going to want to add some Now, it's not for everyone. Granted, absolutely, I will admit that. But when you just get a taste of when you just get a little hint on the nose, you really just can't say no. Now you want to put a spriggin in there, put it back together. And really the most important thing you want to look for here is freshness. Now, I have these fresh strawberries. Well, they were fresh when I got them two weeks ago. You want to take strawberry A, that's you. Strawberry B, the person you're with for now. We know how these things go. Take them and uh, plop them in, plop them in. They can enjoy themselves just as you are enjoying the other person. Actually, if you've been here for a long time, you know that I'm all about free expression. So why don't we add some chaos into that mix there. The next ingredients you want are going to be somewhat unconventional, but equally rewarding. First, you're gonna want this little red guy. I imported him from Argentina, a true specimen of some nature with a vibrant flavor and a great color. He's the first one. And the last one is an egg. Whole egg imported from Bhutan. I spend a near fortune on this little guy. So, first thing you want to do, then to add some final vibrancy to the mix, we're going to add our egg. Now, you gently crack it on the side, and uh, most people just add, you know, egg white. I, I respect the game, but we can, we can throw that whole. Obviously, we're going to filter this thing out in the end, but just to add some mix and some extra flavor to it, we put that little guy in there. And to finish and to finish it all off, we cap it to shake it. Start by capping, capping it off, and then uh, we seal her up. So, this reminds you of a time when I was in Papua New Guinea. And there was this local man who approached me. And then he said, I'll see you next week, kid. Now, with all the ingredients mixed up, we're about to shake. With everything together, mixed. And then we pour. Now, you, typically you can go into whatever glass you really want to, but I can't say no to a chilled tumbler like in this case here. Now to filter it out, a lot of people have many different methods, but you can really use anything you want to have lying around the house. Well, that was a uh, revelatory experience. Now, join me next week for episode 18, where we go over holiday classics. 